Hi there, everybody. Thank you for joining us here in Barcelona. Martin Tyler here with Alan Smith. Our action is from La Liga. It's Barcelona, and they take on Real Sociedad. Well, there's certainly a buzz in this stadium in the uh, minutes leading up to kickoff. I hope the match doesn't disappoint. I don't think it will. We've got a couple of attacking sides here. Well, all the talk is over. Now the game is underway, and Barcelona have started it. Barcelona's lineup here. Marc Andre Testegen starts in goal. Pique starts alongside Clement Longley at the back, and they just go with the one striker up front. Martin Braithwaite. Real Sociedad's lineup. Mikel Merino plays with Martin Odegaard in the centre of the park. Only one up front in terms of an out and out forward. Odegaard. He's got it in behind the defenders for the attack of the chase. Well, there's no doubt here that the visiting teams sort of tremble at the prospect of taking on Barcelona, who have this wonderful home record in the league. Well, nobody really can come close, can they? With 13 wins in 14 games, the home supporters here are just expecting a win every time. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. Very good piece of work by the goalkeeper to turn that away from danger. Griezmann. Dembele. Chance to get forward from the wing. Chance to get it into the middle thanks to the referee playing the advantage. Shot blocked here. In goes the corner. Came in with the header, but didn't come up with the goal. Yeah, he would have hoped to do much better than that. Interception here. Griezmann. He's chosen to cut it back now. And it's in the net and it's Barcelona who scored. Well, it was a decent move and to get some space in a crowded penalty area. Here's the goal again. Oh, look at the manager. He works hard on his team on the training ground and he's seen some reward for it down there now. It's Barcelona in front. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. A really close, great technique there. Oh, there's no finer sight than when you get that right. Unlucky. Sergio Roberto. Sergio Busquets. Frankie de Jong. Dembele. Room now out of the wing. Just taking the heat out of the moment, the ball back to the goalkeeper. Griezmann. Dembele. Safety first there. It's with de Jong. Jordi Alba. Now they're looking to get forward from this position. Couldn't keep it. Dembele. Griezmann. Nothing wrong with that tackle. In fact, it was a terrific effort. 
Not long to go in this first half. Barcelona leading, not really dominating as they can, but cleverly done. He fancies his chances in getting past these players. Looking for teammates in the middle. Headed it well, just wide. Well, not far wide at all. Next time, maybe he'll bury that. Sergi Roberto. Griezmann saw the pass and dealt with it. Sergio Busquets with the interception. And that's the referee's decision. Two added minutes. Now he's got the ball. What's he going to do with it? And that's half time. Signaled by the referee. 1 0 the half time score. Very difficult ground for the visiting team to come. Well, all the talk is over. Now And here we go, the referee's blown his whistle, and we're off for the second half. Well, it will be a throw-in. Sergio Busquets. Dembele. Looking for Busquets. The crossing is a skill, and that's not a very good example of it. They've spoilt the promise of that attack. Well, it'll be a throw now after the tackle. Odegaard. He's got some room out here in the wide position. Very straightforward piece of goalkeeping as he catches the cross. Now it's De Jong. Griezmann. Dembele. Now Martin Odegaard. An imminent change for Real Sociedad. A substitute coming on. Mikel Marino on the attack here. Couple of teammates up in support. Keeper's ball. No question about that. It's a weak cross, really. Dembele. Griezmann. Well, he tried his luck, but his luck was out. Well, there's going to be an alteration now. And with the team trailing, you can understand why he's going to make it. Nacho Monreal. Mikel Marino. Now Martin Odegaard. Substitution on the horizon for Real Sociedad. Well, now they're behind. They've got to try and switch things around. And here comes a substitution. Sergio Busquets. Here's the yacht. Jordi Alba. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. Still 20 minutes to go. Now Martin Odegaard. Stopping the pass, getting through with a good piece of anticipation. Keeping calm in the pursuit of uh, an equalising goal here, not panicking. Well, when you have the quality and the width, that's what this lad brings. You've got a special talent. 
and uh, it's been uh, a special showing as he's replaced now the crowd recognizing that yeah what he's done he, he's hugged the touchline and he's stretched that opposing back line created space for teammates inside and vital performance from him Dembele probing pass Busquets it's been a joy watching Barcelona it invariably is but the opposition have given them a good game and brought some of the qualities out that they might not have needed against a weaker opponent guiding it through the defenders the keeper stops it there could be a follow-up now Iliara Mendy. Look at the watch, and that will tell you six minutes to go. Taking on the opposition and the responsibility as well. Players arriving in the middle. He's gone in with the header, but the ball nowhere near going into the net. I think it's come off the top of his head, that one. Well, this is where substitutes are important. Who and when. Here's De Jong. Griezmann saw the direction of the pass. So easy in possession. The referee has decided to add on two minutes. Jordi Alba. Braithwaite. It's with De Jong. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. And that's it, last blast on the whistle from the referee. Well, you have to get the goals to win, but you also need defenders to stop the opposition. And these defenders have done a fantastic job today. Yeah, and I think the impressive thing, Martin, is the way that they work together as a unit when you look at that back four in particular.